Hey, this is Cave Sack from Custom Audio Reimagined coming at you with another review. Ecstatic went ahead and sent out the Model 3000 like I was hoping, and we're going to go ahead and test it out just like we did the 800. Now, the 3000 is definitely a different battery. This thing's a beast, coming in at almost 70 pounds. It is almost the exact same size as my stock battery, but 20 pounds heavier. I'm pretty excited to see how this thing's going to perform. You shouldn't have any problems hooking up some serious heavy gauge lines to this. The longer the bolt, just keep clamping them down or you can come off with distribution blocks. But regardless, this thing's going to handle what you want it to do. Now, what we're going to do today is we're going to go ahead and put this in my car in place of the Model 800. Pretty excited about getting it in there. And we're going to go ahead and test it with Termlab. We're going to see if we get any gains. We're going to look at the voltages. We're going to do exactly like we did before. So, the next thing we need to do is go ahead and get to the car, get this 800 out, and get this 3000 in. Okay, and here we have the Model 800 in the battery. The standing voltage is 12.37. Let's go ahead and start it up. See the voltage drop? Jumps back up. So uh, we're looking at a running voltage of 14.15, 14.17. Bounce around that area. Performing just fine. Let's go ahead and run Term Lab and uh, see what kind of numbers we're still getting. Okay, so our results with the Model 800 are pretty consistent. Our previous numbers was 131.8. Right now we're at 131.3. Uh, I think the voltage and everything is testing out just fine. Let's go ahead and pull out this 800 and put the 3000 in and see what kind of differences we see. Okay, so we've got the Model 3000 installed in the car and it looks like the resting voltage is sitting at right around 13.2 volts. Um, it's fluctuating, but it's staying around 13 volts. That's great. I think we need to go ahead and start it up, see where she's at with running voltage, run term lab on her, and start comparing notes. Okay, with the car running, the voltage is sitting up around 14 volts, which is just fine. It's where we want to see it at. Uh, term lab is up. It's ready to go. It's going to peak out at the max XP SPL. I'm going to be running a sweep. It's 120 hertz down to 20 hertz, just so we can get a peak reading on where we're at. Okay, so it does look like a gain. Looks like uh, right around 0.7 decibels compared to the Model 800. Um, I'm kind of interested to see what would happen if I went ahead and tried to hit this on a peak frequency. I'm going to go ahead and burp this with a single note. I want to see if it actually raises. Let's see what happens. So there you go. Changing out the battery only, and I've gained a decibel on my system just with changing out the battery. Proof's in the numbers. They don't lie. So, the Batcap Model 3000 by Static. What do I think of it? Um, it's a badass battery, plain and simple. Um, the pros of this battery are, it's a beast. This battery is big, it's heavy, it's mean. It's just like what you would expect if you needed more power. You're not going to get more power just for wishing for it. You're going to have to pay for it in size and weight. And in this battery, you do. Battery is right around nine and a quarter, nine and a half inches with those posts on there or the uh, actual rods coming out of the battery. So it's pretty tall. I'll be more than happy to modify some MDF to fit this gigantic badass battery. I mean, there's, there's no problem with that. So Model 3000 gets my thumbs up. It is a definite beast. It's a workhorse. And if one's going to give me an extra decibel, I can imagine if I bus barred three or four of these things together and what you could do in a DB drag vehicle or hell, what you could even do in my car because I plan on doing upgrades. So definite buy. Model 3000 gets the Cape Sipe seal of approval. I appreciate you watching my review. But now the question is, what am I going to do with the Model 800? I'm going to give it to one of you. I'm going to start my monthly YouTube contest. One of my subscribers every month is going to win something from one of the vendors that I have good relationships with. So, somebody's going to get this Model 800. I'm even going to autograph it for you. Autograph by Cape Snipes and pimp my ride. Keep on pimping. So, subscribe to the channel. If you want a shot at winning this Model 800, thanks for watching my review. Coming from Atlanta all the way to Indiana with calls by Cape Snipes. I'm making your damn right. On stage is popping collars. I'm making a bigger dollar. When the engine holler, the women follow to see the problem. See, he got impalas the same color as pop.